That's why you, you hear people that are like, oh, I started doing yoga and I had demonic experiences. Yeah, because they're in you. They're in you already, y'all. Come on. Um, do you understand what I'm saying here? I know full moon energy today, guys. I'm, I mean, it's heavy. It's heavy, but I'm rolling. I got some good coffee. We're going. Um, this is where the rubber meets the road spiritually. Are you willing to push through that? Are you willing to confront the demons that are already within you? Why are they in you and they haven't said anything? Because they like to be left alone. They're like a splinter that gets under your thumb and it's like, oh, I'm not even here. I'm just going to slowly get infected and you're not even going to notice it. Just, shh, you know, that little numb feeling you get. That's what these things do to you. And by the way, demons are not horned little creatures, uh, little goblins that get in you. Okay. They are energies. They are electrostatic chaos energies. They are not created with. You can create with them. You can wield them and you can tell them what to do and where to go. And you certainly don't need them in your energy centers of your metaphysical body, a.k.a your chakra systems this is a great time for me to to drop this hit up supernaturalblueprint.com it's completely free you can get my free ebook i'm going to go through all the chakras a lot of what i'm talking about today is assuming your understanding of the chakras and i don't mean a little understanding i mean guys i go into it it's about a 14 page free ebook and i'm going to show you exactly how your chakras including 